Bullies, take that. Big stars who have been bullied have been speaking out about their own experiences. Watch this. There were times where we would be in the halls getting our books um, out of the lockers, and I will never forget a kid screamed down the hall and he said, your show sucks, just like that, out loud, in front of all the kids. And I said, you know what, I'm sick and tired of this. I'm finally gonna say something. And then I turned around and I said, well, the check's don't. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think it's like for that kid who's scared and they hear Justin Bieber say, it's happened to me and, and there is help? You know, I think that it's about telling people and you know, if, if you're a bystander to you know, tell somebody because a lot of times it's just not spoken of and then you ended up you end up just keeping it all inside and, and, and then it just hurts even more. Well now there is a brand new campaign to literally stomp out bullying and all the nerds are uniting. Former star of that 70s show Wilmer Valderrama is now a spokesperson for the new campaign by Wonka, the maker of nerds candy. Wilmer joining me from Hollywood. Great to see you as always, Wilmer. Hey, nice to see you, brother. How have you been? I've been great, and I have, I have to tell you, I heard you were involved with this campaign. I have a hard time saying your name and nerd in the same sentence. I think a lot of people would agree <laughs> with me. But, but look, man, I think it is terrific that you're the spokesperson for this new anti-bullying campaign. Why was it important for you to get involved? It's really exciting. I'll, t I'll tell you, man, I'll, 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 I'll beg to differ on that, man. I was... Uh, I mean, I think it takes a big nerd to actually create Fez on that 70s show. <laughs> to be <completely laughs> Well, honest. there's that. Um, there is that, you know. But, um, but you know, I, I was very, very proud of this campaign. You know, it's, uh, it's, uh, through the last couple of years, I've seen how this, this crisis, you know, has spread uh, like a bad disease throughout the teens uh, uh, in America. And, um, and, I, um, and I've seen a lot of the entertainment industry embrace a few formats and a few uh, ways of uh, not just coping, but really trying to, to raise awareness. And I, it was not until I got together with, with the Wonka and, um, and uh, stop, uh, Stomp Out Bullying, which um, we came up with a great campaign, which is, was uh, uh, Nerds Unite. And Nerds Unite basically stands for, for individuality, you know, being original, being, uh, um, uh, you know, being, being uh, uh, understanding that being different is actually a cool thing. Yeah. Um, you know, and I, and, and I tell you, it's, it's one of those situations where I think that a lot of teens today, they just need permission to be themselves. I think that society and the media and, uh, and the entertainment industry has dictated uh, this, this imagery of uh, imagery of uh, of what cool is and what and what hip is and what um, you know um, uh, what 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 the in thing is today and following trends. So you know it's, it's it's important that right now we basically look at these things and we go, hey man, it's okay to be yourself. It's okay to have different views. It's okay to to have different interests. And uh, and and that's and that's where we live. You know, I mean, we live in a place right now where we need to empower them to be themselves in order to create a different nation. And I know for you, and I think this would surprise a lot of people, you actually got bullied and hassled when you first moved to this country because, well, quite frankly, you couldn't speak the language. That's exactly right. And, and that's why I think uh, it was so important for me to uh, join this, 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 uh, this movement. You know, I thought, um, you know, when I first came to the United States and I didn't know how to speak English, I, you know, I, once I learned how to speak English, then I had an accent. And, and even then, it was even harder because when you have an accent and you're 14 years old, you know, that small community, you know, somehow they think about, you know, well, well, you, you're dumb, you're not smart. Yeah. And, um, and it was not until I was able to embrace my individuality and, my, and, and the ability to be different that, and, and, and remembering my roots that I was able to stand my ground and say, hey, you know what, I'm, I'm allowed to have different views, and, I'm allowed to be different. Yeah, and that is why you're such a great role model for this, and I'm so glad you're doing it, Wilmer. Thank it's you. always great to see you. And for more information on Wilmer's new campaign, make sure you go to facebook.com slash Wonka. Thank you so much.